And I don't think it's an understatement to say that most guys who profess to know Jesus Christ are more fear-based than they are faith-based. And the sad thing about that is they don't even know it. We have a problem justifying sin in our lives. We pretty much know sin and the radical sins. Oh, that's shouldn't have done that, shouldn't have said that, that was sin. But the things that we give ourselves passes on and we give others passes on that is just outright sin and offense to God, there's so many things like that in our lives. It's very difficult to be a man of fervent prayer because the fervent prayer of a righteous man availeth much. Sometimes we feel like we just can't sense the Spirit or we don't have any power in the Spirit and it's because we don't. And the reason that we don't is because we quench the Spirit of God in our hearts and in our lives. We quench Him by making little of little sins. Scripture teaches us little sins are like little foxes and they'll spoil the vineyard when you let them in, when you don't deal with them. And that comes with being sensitive about your sin and you're more sensitive about your sin when you're in the presence of God. When you're not in the presence of God and God's presence is not abiding on you and in you, you're not real sensitive to what you say and what you do or what might be sin. It might be a critical spirit or profanity. And we give ourselves passes on how we speak and the words that we use. But words mean something. Words reveal the heart of a man. See, my faith grows the more that I see God and who God is and the attributes of God. The more I'm in His presence. You guys think maybe we beat on the drum too much around here about getting guys in journey groups. All we're trying to do is get guys in God's presence. Transformation comes through proximity. You get in his presence and you're going to change just like the guy next to you. If you hang around him long enough, now look at him long and hard because you're going to become just like him. You hang around him enough. God have mercy on our souls. I figured some of y'all would get up and move at that point. Okay. <laughs> if you like this message and you'd like to see the full sermon, you can find it on our Vimeo channel. Link is in the description. A Minister to Men is an online ministry of Influencers West. You can find us on Facebook, Twitter, or go to our website to sign up for our weekly podcast. If you'd like to see more M2M short videos like this, click on any of the video thumbnails to see more. And to be notified when a new M2M video is up, why not subscribe? We upload new videos every Tuesdays and Thursdays. Thank you for watching, and God bless you.